Okay, my people. Remember this place? This was their school. I'm heading out to take some photos of leading lines for you guys. So, here we go. All right, so here I am outside and I kind of like the cool shadow, right, that's happening here. So, I'm just trying to move around and see where it's actually kind of like a cool shot. Shadow. Let's see how those kind of lines leading you around and through the photo, the lines of the shadow, the lines of the fence. Yeah, that's kind of cool. So here I'm looking at kind of like the lines on this fence here. And I think this graffiti here would kind of be like my focal point or kind of my point of interest there so there's some kind of like lines leading you to that like beware part over there let me look at it from a different angle and see if that's better there's like the beware there move down so you can get a better angle anyway just kind of move your camera around find different positions where it kind of looks best. So here, I'm not really sure. It's just I see lines and I see like, you know, circles and movement. So I tried to see if there's something that would end up being like a cool shot here getting my reflection in there. I don't know if I want that. It's kind of neat right there. Okay, so remember you don't always want to have your camera going landscape. You can go, you know, up and down portrait mode as well. So here I'm kind of just like looking at this graffiti on the pole here, which is kind of neat. Kind of just like an up and down line, like running through the whole frame. Just kind of get, looking at it from maybe a different angle and having the sun coming through there. That's kind of a cool shot right there. Here is like the bike rack in the front of the school and that shot there kind of with like the, the lock and looking through the center of it is really neat like that. Look at it in a different way. I guess that's it. I don't know, I kind of like that one from what I had there. That's kind of neat from that angle right there too.